What's up YouTube? It's your boy XDG back on the GTA X channel. Happy New Year to you guys and I hope you had an awesome holiday, all right? So today we'll be installing the GTA Save Editor 3.3.0.0. Now I know I haven't uploaded any Save Editor videos in like five months. Update 1.51 pretty much patched what you guys like to call Save Wizard Outfits and I didn't really see a reason to do a GTA Save Editor video. But recently I've been getting a lot of activity on that last update video. So I decided to hit you all up with this banger on the 3.3 update. Now, a lot of you guys been having issues with the save editor. I mean, the thing is this joint works for me like 100%. So I have no idea what's not working for y'all or how to fix most of y'all problems. But I can tell you it comes down to your OS or operating system. I'm running Windows 10 64 bit. Now, depending on what you guys are running, this may or may not cause issues, but I can tell you 100% it works for me every time running windows 10 so you guys that have been having problems uh, check your windows version and also check your antivirus a save editor is not like an ordinary program and your AV might detect it as a virus. I've seen some dudes that have no idea how to use their computer saying, oh, no, I got a virus now, thanks. Uh, that's just total BS. It's just your antivirus trying to protect you, right? Now, if you don't want to install it because of your AV, I'm not here to tell you what to do on your own computer, right? All I can say is it's not a virus, period. Anyway, guys, without further ado, let's go ahead and get this thing installed. Y'all know the vibe. You're going to start by uninstalling the old version, then doing a clean install of the new version. Let's get it popping. All right, you want to head to add or remove programs and we're just going to remove this 3.1.1. Hit on install. All right, and boom, that's that. Yes, sir. We need to get the 3.3 update on our computer. Now, the best place to get this software is going to Twitter and searching XB36 Hazard. And you want to just check his recent tweets. He always updates when he releases a new software. Obviously, there's the Red Dead Redemption 2 save editor as well. This is what we're looking for, the new GTA 5 save editor. As you can see right here, it says download. To the right, you have all the information first released last update this thing has been out for seven years dang i'm mean, just gonna hit our download link right here all right so this is the file you should get right here xp36 hazards launcher 0300 it will be in the zip format so i have winrar installed on my computer so i'm just gonna right click and hit extract here once you have the launcher extracted just go ahead double click it now the launcher is where you're going to download the actual GTA save editor, all right? As you can see, there's a bunch of games here and you just want to search obviously for GTA 5 save editor and just hit install. All right, so that's done for me. It insta installed. What? <laughs> so I'm just going to hit run right here. Right, so bang, we got this update, resource master update available. Click yes to go to the download page. All right, I'm gonna just hit yes. Resources master, I'm just gonna download it. Right here, I'm just gonna go ahead and tag the file. So let's go, the file is downloaded. I'm just gonna go ahead and select it and hit open. So we got a pop-up, editor will now close. Please restart for update to take effect. Once that's closed, let's hit run once again. All right, so once everything goes smoothly, you should have the save editor on your PC. The last update, December 24th, 2020. So we know everything is Gucci. Let's click here and bam. I'm just going to open a random file right now. Boom, everything is here working just like it does for me every time. I really can't, like, it's so hard for me to help you guys that are having problems because I don't know honestly where to start because, like, th this always works for me and I have no problems at all. What you can try to do is go back to XB36's Twitter page and shoot a tweet on one of his posts. Maybe he will respond. Sometimes he does, sometimes he doesn't. For the most part, I think his DMs are turned off. But yeah, man, everything 100% working. All right, guys, so that about wraps up today's video i think i covered pretty much everything you need to install the program flawlessly i had no issues the only thing i can actually think about is your os make sure you're running windows 10 64 bit if you're not and it doesn't work that's pretty much why <laughs> and i really don't have a fix once again you want to head over to twitter hit up xb36 maybe he can help
It's been your boy XDG. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next GTA X video. Oh my god. Peace out. Is it?